Something magic happens Every time you go You make the magic happen The magic of Orioles baseball How's everybody doing today? Autographs 2000 here. And in today's video, I have got five autographs through the mail, TTMs to show you. And I've also got some friend mail I want to show. As always, we will start with some TTMs. The first one is from Richmond, Virginia. We have got Gary Lavelle. He signed 4 of 4 in 70 days. He had a career record of 80 and 77 with a 2.93 ERA. He also had 136 saves. He played 13 years, appeared in 745 games. He played from 74 to 87. He played with San Francisco, Toronto, and Oakland. He was a two-time All-Star. He was an All-Star in 77 and 83. Both of those years, he had 20 saves. Um, he is in the San Francisco Giants Wall of Fame. And his best year was in 1978 when he had 13 wins and 14 saves. That was, a, that was, a def that was definitely a pretty solid season right there. 1978. Again, that is Gary Lavelle. All right, our second return comes to us from Charleston, South Carolina. And we have got Tom Bradley. He signed three of three in 16 days. He had a career record of 55 and 61 with a 3.72 ERA. He played seven years. He appeared in 103 games. He played from 69 to 75. And he played with California, the White Sox, and the Giants. Um, in 1971 and 1972, both years, he had 15 wins. Tom Bradley. So we're starting it off with two, two Giants pitchers. <clears throat> Our third return comes to us from Columbus, Ohio. We have got Mr. Dan Briggs. He signed three of three in 10 days. He had a career batting average of 195. With 12 home runs, 53 RBIs. He played seven years. He appeared in 325 games. He played from 71 to 82. And he played with California, Cleveland, San Diego, Montreal, and the Cubs. And his best year was in 1979 when he hit eight home runs, knocked in 30, and batted 207. Dan Briggs. Um, and before we get our last two returns, I want to show you some friend mail that I got from a very loyal supporter of the channel. And that is Mr. Michael Ivey. And he sent me some autographs. And he also sent me a sweet Cal Ripken. First, let me show you the autographs that he sent me. Mr. Scott McGregor, Gary Ranicki, and Dave Schmidt. Three nice Orioles autographs. Thank you, Mr. Ivy. 
But he also sent me this. This Jumbo Cal Ripken. Now, I absolutely love that card. I think that's awesome. That is awesome. Thank you again, Mr. Michael Ivey. Greatly, greatly appreciate it. Yep, I think he's too big to sit on the stand. But we're going to find a place for him in my room. And that is pretty sweet. Again, thank you very much for that. Our next return is from West Palm Beach, Florida. And we have got Rick Cerrone. He signed one of one in 34 days. He had a career batting average of 245 with 59 home runs, 436 RBIs. He played 18 years. He appeared in 1,329 games. He played from 79 to 92. He played with Cleveland, Toronto, the Yankees, the Braves, the Brewers, the Red Sox, the Mets, and the Expos. His best year was in 1980 when he hit 14 home runs, knocked in 85, and batted 277. And he also finished seventh in the MVP voting that year. Rick Cerrone. And our final return comes to us from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And we have got the Philly Fanatic. He signed two of two in 21 days. He was first seen um, April 25th, 1978. He was inducted into the Mascot Hall of Fame in 2005. And he is widely regarded as the best mascot in baseball. And he's also the most sued mascot in baseball. Um, if you want to read up on him some more, he has got, there is a ton to read about the Philly Fanatic on Wikipedia. It's a pretty interesting read. And that, guys, is going to do it for this video. As always, I hope you enjoyed it. I appreciate and thank you for watching. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And until next time, guys, Autographs 2000 is out.